The cost of Meghan Markle's lavish New York City baby shower has been revealed, so far amassing a total of $279,201. Ninety-eight. The seven months pregnant royal touched down in New York City on Friday to attend a baby shower being thrown for her by her nearest and dearest pals after spending Valentine's Day with Prince Harry. Between lavish gifts from friends to the cost of her royal protection security and extravagant dinners, the royal's week in the city for her baby shower has already amounted to hundreds of thousands of dollars. Meghan's baby shower, which is set to take place on Wednesday afternoon, will take place in the Mark Hotel Grand Penthouse Suite, which boasts gorgeous views of Central Park. The cost of Meghan Markle's baby shower the Mark Hotel Grand Penthouse Suite $150,000 five nights and a one-bedroom suite at the Mark Hotel $9,982. Zero five dinner for four at the Polo Bar Aprox. $420 with drinks lunch at the Surrey Cafe Ball at Aprox. $78 afternoon tea for two at Lagerie Aprox. $25 two Royal Protection Officers $86,316 British Airways flight from London to Nick $26,202 Harp Player Aaron Hill $625 away carry on cases, $17, $3,825 gifts, Baby Aletto Hudson 3-in-1 Convertible Crib $37,910 feet Mandarin Tree Aprox. $140 Lady Fleur Neck Roses Aprox. $399.95 Carnival King Cotton Candy Machine $199. $99 Track Bicycle Aprox. $609.99 Total $279,201.98 It is thought that the $75,000 a night suite has been rented out for two nights in order to allow for the baby shower preparations to be made. Therefore, the total cost of the penthouse amounts to $150,000. The soon-to-be mother also chose to stay at the same lavish Upper East Side Hotel for her stay in New York. It is thought that she opted for a one-bedroom suite in the hotel, Five nights in the Manhattan one-bedroom suite at the Mark Hotel costs a whopping $9,982. 05.A one-night stay in the one-bedroom suite at the Mark Hotel costs $1,735 including bed and breakfast with food from the Jean George's restaurant. Without breakfast, the cost for a one-night stay in the Mark Hotel is $1,695. Therefore, if Meghan opted out of food during her hotel stay she would get the five nights for a cheaper rate of $8,745. All rates for rooms include taxes and fees. The 37-year-old dined out at the Polo Bar on Tuesday night with five friends including Serena Williams and stylist Jessica Mulroney. The cost of a dinner at the exclusive Midtown restaurant would have cost approximately $420 with drinks included. The Duchess was also spotted heading into Lagerie in Soho with close friend Jessica Mulroney, a Canadian stylist, over the weekend for afternoon tea for two, where one macaron retails for $2. Eighty. Therefore, after four macarons, $11.20, and two teas, $7, Megan's afternoon tea at the luxury bakery amounted to about $25. Megan headed out for lunch at Cafe Ballad at the Surrey with friends on Tuesday. The restaurant features a $39 two course lunch six days a week, meaning Megan's lunch at the restaurant cost a total of $78. Throughout her trip, the Duchess has been accompanied by two royal protection constables, who can earn up to $104,954 a year. 
for six days, it would have cost approximately $7,193.04 per Royal Protection Constable. Altogether, the cost of two Royal Protection Constables is approximately $43,158.24 each $86,316 in total. It is thought that Meghan flew first class from London to New York on a British Airways flight. A five-night return trip could cost around $8,734.04. The Duchess flew with her two royal protection officers, bringing the total cost to $26,202. A private jet would certainly have made for a more comfortable flying experience for the pregnant Duchess, who is expecting her first child in the spring. However, it would have added to the already colossal cost of the entire trip. If the cost of Prince Harry's private jet that he recently chartered to reunite with his wife on Valentine's Day is anything to go by, as it cost a whopping $26,100. And according to Private Fly, it could cost anywhere between $78,376 and $379,000 to charter a return flight on a private jet from London to New York, depending on the size and make of the plane and the number of days it was required to be on call. Meghan's baby shower has so far seen a number of different lavish gifts being delivered to the hotel. A baby Aletto Hudson 3-in-1 convertible crib, the $379, and a 10-foot mandarin tree, Aprox. $140 were brought to the hotel on Wednesday morning. A large bouquet featuring dozens of long stem pink roses from Lady Fleur Nick, Aprox. $399.95 was also among the gifts seen being delivered on Wednesday morning. A Carnival King Cotton Candy Machine, $199. $99 was also spotted. Later in the afternoon, a guest was spotted carrying in a children's Trek bicycle. Trek kids' bicycles range between $169.99 for a Kickster training bike for toddlers and $1,049. $99 for a children's mountain bike, meaning that the average bike from the brand costs approximately $609. Zero, zero. Several regular-sized away cases were also seen, being delivered to the mark, each of which cost $225. Approximately 17 of the carry-on cases can be seen, the cost of which amounts to $3,825 in total. New York City harpist and singer Erin Hill was also spotted entering the venue on Wednesday with her harp and other equipment. The average cost for the award-winning harpist to play at an event is $625.